1974. For the first time in history, a political crisis forces an American president out of office. I shall resign the presidency effective at noon tomorrow. High fashion is on the rise as the trend conscious trade Birkenstocks for platforms. Newspaper heiress Patty Hearst is kidnapped by the Symbionese Liberation Army and later joins her captors in robbing a bank. Hank Aaron finally topples the Babe's 39-year-old home run record. And Beta Sultanfuss has become a teenager. How about this flowered wallpaper for your room? How about this? All right, number one, here we go for rehearsal. Take one more shot and we move on. All right, here we go, picture. Roll it. Columbia Pictures and Imagine Entertainment present My Girl 2, the adventures of a young teen searching for identity in an era that seems to be recycling itself. Cut. Okay, good. Print that. I just think in American culture, we yearn for the, the retro. It really was a time in the early 70s that was still fairly innocent for young women. Dad, when a boy likes you, does he pretend that he doesn't like you? And if he pretends that he doesn't like you, how can you tell that he likes you? What boy likes you? It's just a question. It's not about anybody. Uh-oh, here comes puberty. 71 Baker, take one, Mark. Directed by Howard Zeef, My Girl 2 reunites the whole Sultan Fuss clan. Anna Klumsky is Veda. Dan Aykroyd is Veda's father, Harry. Jamie Lee Curtis is Shelley. Richard Masser is Uncle Phil. Christine Ebersole joins the ensemble as Uncle Phil's girlfriend, Rose. And Austin O'Brien is Nick. And cut. Veda grew up a motherless child in a funeral home. I don't think anybody else in the world grew up like Veda Sultanfuss. I'm 13. Maybe it's about time I had my own apartment. You got a smile so like many teens, Veda is beginning to examine her roots. My mother can't have any more kids. Not if you mind. She's dead. Everything I know about her fits into one little box. She came to town with this traveling theater group. Two weeks later, we were married, and almost nine months later, you were here, and she was gone. It was a nice funeral. But Veda's past is more mysterious than most. She was a spy against the Russians. Oh, please, who do you think you're kidding? She's what I call a normal, average American, healthy, normal American girl. Shelly's already told me all about sex. She told me, too. I mean, she told me she told you about sex. And I personally knew about sex long before I met Shelly. I figure you did. I play the classic American sympathetic father who knows least. You know, always the last to find out and completely trumped at every turn by this uh, precocious and uh, clever daughter that, that I have in the person of, of Veda. I want you to write about someone very special, someone who has achieved something and someone you've never met. Veda, what about you? Who have you come up with? My mother. Your mother? I never met my mother. All she knows is if she liked peanut butter and banana sandwiches. I mean, she doesn't know anything, really. Margaret Ann Moldovan, born in Los Angeles, California.